Hi Virgos, welcome to your horoscope for May 2020. As I was putting the cards out, I was hearing that song from Ghostbusters. So I will say, you know, just use your intuition if there is something that that is a bit strange or, you know, or you like, what's going on? Um, this is not normal. Just, I'm going to say, use your intuition on that. Uh, and so in saying that, it's like, it's going to, I feel like it could be a bit of a, when I've got these birth cards coming out, it could be a bit of a quiet month. And you're just like, oh, that's strange. Like, it's why is it so quiet for me? Um, it's like you've been put on hold. Like, it's like you can pull on the shelf a little bit because um, you're just not needed to do as much. Which um, I feel like it also can be like a bit of a waiting game as, as well. And I feel like June is going to pick up, pick up again, but right now you're in this sort of, let's say it's like hold and you're a bit, because you're on hold, you're a bit lost for wear in, in that. This card sort of came out where it's like, she's a bit, looks a bit lost for wear. So, when I am looking at work for you, for some of you it's time to make a stand at work. It might feel like at work, like your world sort of turned upside down, where, you know, what you thought, what is is not um what you've been promised he's not being delivered and it, it you know, i don't some of you don't feel like you're going to leave as such it is more about standing your ground um like i said it is going to be like you are put on hold um for this month you might find it a bit emotional a bit of a challenge um even some of you who are like you know doing like spiritual workers like light workers um it's it's a time a month of dreaming a time of just taking a bit of rest a rest And also just, it's like, just be aware, aware. And all I'll say is that it is what it is for you guys. Um, I just feel like it might be a time, a month where you might have to spend a bit more money as well. It's like you're having to, there's different things coming up which you need, you need to put your attention in. Let me look at loved ones, relationships. I feel like if there could be an argument or someone I'm not listening to you or understanding you, this could be a friendship or it could be a lover. Um, just be a bit cautious of that. I just feel like you might be getting a bit frustrated. This person has a ton of ideas and they're showing, trying to show you, but it's like you think you know better and you're just not going to listen to them. Even though it might be a good idea, you have your own idea on what you want to do. In saying that as well, I will say you this month, you just need to be grateful and have unity as well. I feel like that's the unity is going to be with your um, family, more so with your sisters and brothers. It is a time of unity being being with them. I do feel like more. Um, and I also get it's also about just staying home. I know we are stuck at home at the moment, but for you, it's just like, the sta I just feel like the staying home. Um, so I know some people are still going out, still doing things. But for you, I don't get that. In terms of health, I just feel like you need to guard your heart. It's like your heart needs to be guarded this month. You need to put a big, big shield on. Um, you need to find that inner peace. You need to be able to retreat um, and just have have some guidance. Um, and try not to worry too much what's going on around you. It is what, as I said, it is what it is. You can't change it. And in the long run, things will start looking up again. You just have to be on a hiatus for the moment. So I will leave it there for you, Virgos. So thank you for liking, thank you for sharing, and I'll see you again for your horoscope in June.